Hi, welcome back to EducateTube.com. My name is Sipsky, your host. Last time I showed you my modified telescope to my Sony camera, which I was able to do a what we call a telezoom uh, like lens. It's actually a, a camera that's hooked up to a telescope that allowed me to zoom in uh, 1600 millimeter uh, like lens or 4,450 millimeter uh, zoom lens. So it's like a prime lens. You can just switch the uh, eyepiece and you get uh, two versions of it 1600 millimeter and 4,450 millimeter. And allow me to zoom in about uh, 32 times to 89 times, which is a great idea. Now let's do the opposite. Instead of zooming into the macro world, what about the micro world? So here we have a microscope. This is a very nice microscope. In fact, this is a stereo microscope. Okay, as you can see, this is a stereo microscope. Uh, you can, there is the ocular lens, two of them. So you can look uh, under a microscope microscopically in stereo view. What's special about this uh, microscope is that it has a ocular tube allows me to hook up my camera, any type of camera, onto this. Now you need a special adapter for this. Uh, I have a Nikon adapter, right, that allows me to put a Nikon camera. But the problem is I sold my Nikon camera and I went with a Sony. So how do you hook up, here we have a Sony A6300, hook up to this Nikon adapter to the microscope. Well, what you need is of course, is a uh, manual adapter. You can buy it for around uh, 10 to 20 bucks. It's Nikon to Sony NEX camera. So uh, here is a basically an E-mount type of adapter. So from Nikon uh, to E-mount adapters, right? Nikon F lens to ne um, to E-mount Sony adapter. So what happened is all I have to do is take out this adapter and place it onto, let me come closer so you can see, right, and just line up the red dots, you can see there, to the, le to the camera and snap it in. You hear that click? That's in now. Now you, you have a um, Nikon to Sony and then to the camera okay and what I'll do is now place it onto this tube adapter for the camera and I'm able to turn on and view what's inside. Let me see if I, I'll take one of the uh, slides that I have and we are going to see some specimen. Right here I have a uh, honeybee work leg specimen that I bought. Comes in uh, like 100 different slides of different specimens so this is one of them. So it's our pre-made so that's great. Later on I'm going to show you how to make one, your own slide. So here we go, let's put it in. Now the cool thing about this is I can look through the stereo ocular lens or look at that. I can look through that as well through the LCD screen, and uh, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go with that for now, and let's see if you can see that. Let's bring it in closer. I'll bring this. Okay, as you can see there. Okay, so now we're gonna have a look what this camera sees. All right, as you can see here, we have a uh, hind leg of a honeybee and starting with the balsitalsis, the large structure there. And then as we move down, there is this four segmented tarsus, including its claw right there. Quite beautiful, isn't it? A 1080p uh, view, uh, 12 times, I believe. This is 12 times zoom. Beautiful structure. You see the claw there, the four claws. Now, if you're inspired to become an entomologist or your kids, a good start is to uh, give them a microscope. 
and here we go we are zooming in now 30 times uh, you can see here uh, the claw up close at 30 times four claws you can see there and you notice the uh, fine hair like structure along the claws the hair like structure is actually found all over the honeybees um, um, bodies and its uh, legs now the thing about this is that it's able to this is how it's able to spread the pollen to the stigma of the flowering plant thus fertilizing the plant so um, it's uh, hair like structure very important you can see here God's creatures is just amazing if you look under a fine detail under a microscope you can see so much uh, uh, function okay so you can see we're gonna move up the uh, talsus the four segmented part of the leg the talsus and then towards the bossy talsus and you can see right there uh, very fine hair like structure wow amazing hope you enjoy thanks for watching educate2.com